everybody wants to have a fast website and WordPress sometimes can be a little slow especially when you start to have image heavy websites using things like Elementor page builders, WooCommerce, those kinds of things. In this video, we're going to take a look at a free plugin to see exactly what that can do and if it can improve our starting point. My name is Paul C. This is WP Test, the channel where I help you get more out of WordPress and ultimately make more money. Okay, so the plugin we're going to be using is called FastPress. This is totally free and it's a kind of one click install and that's all you need to do. First of all, before we go any further though, quick props and shout out to Imran from Web Squadron. He brought this to my attention for my recent video on 13 free plugins you really need to check out. Link in the corner and in the description to check that video out and also to Imran's channel. Check it out, subscribe, be notified. Okay, so this is the plugin we're going to be using. Before we go any further, let's just take a quick look at what our starting point is. So first of all, this is the website. This is just an Elemental Pro template. I've loaded in with everything in place. So as you can see, quite a few images, there's some video, bits and pieces like that. A typical website you'd expect to kind of see. I've already gone ahead and done a page speed test on this. You can see there's the URL. And you can see this is coming back with a pretty poor performance score, 50. And if we take a look at the desktop, it is considerably better, but still not perfect. So let's go ahead and take a look. First of all, this is on site ground. And I just want to come in and show you that the direct delivery has been disabled. The dynamic cache, unfortunately, I can't disable it, but that has been cleared. And also the memcached is disabled. So we have as little as possible going on on site ground to make sure that we're kind of hitting the ground running with a pretty clean slate. Okay, so let's go over into the dashboard of that WordPress website. Let's come into our plugins and let's go ahead and enable FastPress. We'll activate this and let's go into the settings. And as you can see, it is pretty minimal. These are all the standard settings that you're gonna sort of start off with. Now, there's a couple of things inside here, like the optimizing CSS, loading JavaScript asynchronously, and those kinds of things. Always check your website when you install something like this to make sure that everything is working. And if you change any of these values, make sure you clear your cache and also go ahead and run some tests to make sure that everything is working. We've enabled it. Let's go over to the website. Let's refresh this. Let's just check everything is loading in as we would expect it to. And everything looks pretty much the same as it did before. Okay, we're looking pretty good. So now let's just jump over to PageSpeed Insights. Let's go ahead and reanalyze this page and see what scores we get. So after letting the test run, you can see we have now improved our bottom line scores. We've jumped up 24 points on mobile. If we jump over to the desktop, we are just around about the 100 mark. So pretty good. It's not that difficult to get the sort of good scores on desktop, but it is good to see that the mobile is now considerably better. And as we can see, we are under that golden two seconds. Straight out of the box for something that costs zero money, that is pretty good. So I'd say a 25% speed increase for literally just going ahead and installing the plugin and doing no configuration is a pretty good result. So you may want to check out FastPress for yourself and see how it works for you. Obviously, your mileage may well vary depending upon the tools you have installed and the server and all those million different options. But it's worth checking out and seeing if it gives you that nice little bit of a speed boost. As always, all applicable links are in the description. Mine is Paul C. This is WP Tuts. Until next time, take care.